struggling, man. Like, I guess this is how it is sometimes. So, I've been going out for like the past four weeks and I literally can't get anything. It's been super cold out. The wildlife are like non-existent. So, about a week or so ago, I went out to the store, got a bird feeder, put it up in my backyard so the small birds would like, you know, obviously get used to coming to my backyard. And so they've been coming slowly and slowly. So what I did this morning is, I got a couple saw horses, I just got some flat boards, put a couple logs on top, and just made like, you know, a little bird perch or whatever it's called. I don't even know what they're called. This whole bird th photography thing is relatively new to me. The whole wildlife thing is relatively new to me. And yeah, I have my blind set up here in my backyard, and I'm just gonna hang tight for a while and see if we can get anything, like, whew. So I don't know. Let me show you what I got set up in the back of the camera, how it looks. Okay, so if you can see here, I just got the, you can see the tops of the sawhorses and the boards. I'm just gonna zoom in to 600 millimeter, and then if I come up like this, you know, you can just see the logs there. So that's a little setup. Now it's just a game of sit and wait. And that's the key thing in wildlife photography is just ridiculous amounts of patience. And to be honest with you, for about 90% of my life, I have been the most impatient person ever. But doing wildlife photography the last year has like really changed that. And it's for the better, because it's starting to be implemented into my regular life as well. So let's just sit tight in my backyard and see what we can get. We got a cardinal, and we got two of these gray birds so far. Okay, so this is day two. I've been out here since about 7 a.m. and uh, lots of action, lots of action out here. I left the blind out overnight. I left the table out, all that stuff so they're a little bit more used to it. And this morning we got the woodpecker in. The same cardinal showed up again. There's been a blue jay flying around and uh, I don't know, he hasn't landed, but I mean, lots of action going on ever since I came out here. So yeah, I'm gonna stay out here for a couple more hours probably. Um, and see what we can find. It's about 9.30 in the morning, and uh, 
Yeah, so definitely the most of the action was around 7.30 when I first got out here, which was actually about an hour later than the sun came up. Um, but you know, it's your backyard, you're in your bed. It's tough to get out a little bit in the morning. Um, I think this is gonna do it for this video. This was awesome. What an awesome experience. I had so much fun making this. So I'm definitely gonna do this again. I've learned a lot. Like that's up a little bit too high. Uh, should be lower. Uh, but yeah, it was great. So anyways, I hope you guys really enjoyed the video. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. If I got like any of the bird names wrong, leave a comment below, help me out. I'm new to this bird photography thing. So you gotta work with me a little bit now. But anyways. Alright, thanks again for watching. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you guys in the next video.